Hey guys, so welcome or welcome back to my channel. <laughs> this is just gonna be a quick little video because I'm just gonna go through this um, video and like show you guys my product empties before I throw them in the trash. Um, so I've been sticking this stuff to the side so that I can share it with y'all and show y'all the stuff that I actually went through. Um, Cause I don't feel like I go through products as much as a lot of other people do. I use a lot of products, but I don't feel like I go through them as much as some people. Like when I watch other people's products in this video, like I don't know how often they do the videos, but when they show them, it's like, Jesus Christ, you got a whole lot of stuff. For your product empties but mine it don't be that much um but anyways i have to go cook it's always something in my house always i gotta go cook so i'm gonna make this quick <laughs> if i can stop um sorry about this right here you guys that light that's my dome light above my shower um but i'm in here recording because i've been stashing all my stuff and then my boyfriend's in my makeup room or whatever so i was like i just do the video and they're standing it's gonna be quick anyways if i stop talking first product empties this is the only one i kept this is my um this is an eyelash case for my lash extensions this is just one that i kept but i always have a lot of of these empty because i go through them the next thing is this wild growth hair oil i have been trying to finish this oil for the longest because i went from using this to using this and this is the second bottle back to using this because but i really feel like this my heel um this one actually worked and it's like right there it's almost done but i was like let me go ahead and get rid of this because when i told y'all before once something kind of gets down to the bottom i'm like it's time to get rid of it it's driving me crazy like it has like a little bit of corner in there but i can't get it out so this one is pretty much done um this Polish Choice um, Exfoliate BHA Liquid Exfoliant. This is one of the things I use to help get rid of my acne. Now, I was wondering one day, should I, because it says unclogs, unclogs and shrinks enlarged pores, smooths and even skin tone, lightweight liquid absorbs quickly. I'm wondering if I go, but I'm scared, but I'm wondering, because I have texture on my cheek, on both cheeks, like right here. And right here, I have texture on the same spot on both sides. I did get some down here, but it cleared up it all because it's not. It normally doesn't sit there, but the texture on my cheeks right here, y'all. Can y'all see it? Y'all can see that little texture. Um, I wonder will this if I continuously use this. But what I'm scared of is that if I go back to using this, because right now my my makeup or not my makeup my face routine is really really mild. So I'm going to record the video, but it's like every time I get ready to record, I break out. And it's always because I remember to record around my cycle. So this bump popped up this week because of my cycle. But I was like, whatever, it doesn't matter. It's a part of being a woman. When you still have your cycle, you get pimples when you're on your cycle. That is what it is. But yeah, so I'm wondering if I go back to this to try like keep my skin smooth, will um, it break out? I'm scared because I have the... Tatcha, the rice water, I think it's the rice, something, the rice water, I think it was rice water, the little, the scrub they had, I don't know which one it was, I don't know if it was this or if it was that had my skin looking like a bowling ball, like between all the products that I was using, my skin had, was so smooth, it kind of, it had a glow to it, like a shine, but I'm not oily, so it wasn't that, but I'm scared to try it and see which one it was, I don't know yet. I'm still debating, but this one is empty, so I'll have to buy another one anyways. Then I have this Differin Gel. This is also acne treatment, a Dapoline acne treatment. Um, this works to get rid of, well, it works for me, to get rid of um, acne. But you have to actually, like, use it. And I guess, I don't know, like, it'll get rid of the pimples quicker. And I notice when I use this, and if I have a full pimple, if I use this and use a Mighty Patch, whatever my pimple is, it is going to pull it out, take the redness out, it's going to go away. So, I need to get another one of these just to keep it on deck to have it for when, you know, because they're going to come. 
Next is this Miel's Pomegranate Honey and Leave-In Conditioner. This one, I already have another one of these in this little thing. This right here is where I keep all of my bathroom stuff because I don't have, I have a cabinet, of course, under my sink. But y'all know I'm a product girl. Me and my boyfriend actually like products. So this right here has four shelves in it and we put all of our stuff in that, that thing right there. But yeah, this is the leave-in conditioner. There's another one in there. I did have three other hair products that I used and finished at the same time. But I threw them away not thinking about doing a products video, a products empties video. And then like two weeks later, I still thought about doing the video by the time, of course, the trash was gone. But yeah, so I don't, but I don't remember what the other hair products were. But this is the one that I saved after I realized, oh, Nadia, you need to do a product empties video. So that's that. Next, <laughs> let me just tell y'all, some stuff you cannot skimp on, you cannot be cheap on, and if you do, you will pay the price for it. These. I bought these Breeze Comfort Foam Free Pads. I was in Dollar General one day, and I was running through there, grabbed these, because I was like, I was first of all, Dollar General is high. So I was like, let me just grab these. They're, I think, I guess the Dollar General brand. And since I wasn't, and I wore one of them just to wear overnight. This is, you can see, overnight down here, overnight unscented. So I was like, let me get these just to wear overnight, and um, it'll be fine. So I ended up wearing them during the day sometime. Mm -mm. Some things you cannot skimp on in feminine products for your cycle is one of those things. Oh, those things they talk about compared to Always Infinity. Absolutely not. I would not skimp on pads anymore because <laughs> it was so many times I was paranoid wearing these things like, oh my God, am I going to have an accident and it's going to show? I'm going to be so mad. So I found myself wearing tampons, a tampon with these pads. Just ridiculous. I finished them because y'all, I told y'all I'm not in the market to throw nothing away no more. I finished them. They are gone, but I would never buy them again. Let me put this stuff back in here. All right, next we have this Equate Multi-Action Whitening Rinse. This is the mouthwash. I bought this a while ago. This thing is huge, but I finally finished. And I'm going to tell y'all why I wanted to go ahead and finish this and get rid of it. This was my daytime mouthwash. It's not bad. Um, I don't really have anything bad to say about it, but I won't be buying it anymore because I found one that I really, really love. So, yeah. Next, I have this Olay Nighttime Rinse Off Body Conditioner. Love it. I love the way this smells. I have another one down there that I need to put in the shower so that I can actually use that one too. These smell really, really good. And they actually work. Like once you use these in the shower and then you get out, you can feel the moisture in your skin after you get out. I'm trying to stop looking at myself right here and start looking in the frame. But you can actually feel yourself, the moisture on your skin when you use these. So I already had a backup one of this one, so I didn't um I didn't have to get one of these. And this one has B B30? Looks like an eight. Plus retinol in that one. Next. Of course, this was going to be in here, Dr. Bronner's Peppermint Soap. I don't have to say too much about these. Y'all know what it is with these. Okay. Let's see what else we got. Next is this Style Factor Edge Booster. One of y'all asked me one day what edge control I use. This. This is the edge control I use. This is, what scent is this? Lemon Candy. I have a new one already. I have strawberry. It smells like strawberry. I think I like the lemon candy better though. Yeah, I do. I like the lemon candy. It don't matter what it smells like. It goes on your hair. Nobody can smell it when you put it on your hair anyway. But this edge control works really, really, really well for my hair. Y'all have seen it on my videos, especially when I wear my puff. You can really tell um, that I have it on hand. Next, I am a blend a Dove Calming 0% Sulfate SLES Pistachio Cream and Magnolia Dove Body Wash. This smells good. And every time, but it's open, it's pistachio and cream. But every time I would wear this, my boyfriend and Keelan, 
they would both say I smelled like a baby every time. And but it is a very pistachio scent. I like the way this smells, but I do not like the way it feels. Like when it comes out of the bottle, it's of course the creamy, milky dove texture, but it's a thinner one. So it is not thick creamy, it's thin creamy, kind of like a lotion. So when I would squirt it out, it would run. Like it would, I would have to catch it. Rather like the other ones when you squirt them out, they're thick and creamy. So you can go like this on that. You can't do this one like that because this one will put, squirt out so much product onto your towel, washcloth, whatever you bathe with. It's like too much because it's thinner. So it's runny. I do like the scent, but I don't like the texture of how this comes out onto the, um, onto the towel. Next we have, oh my God, y'all, I cannot believe I finished this. Y'all know I am sick about finishing this. Prada candy. I have been a boy. I still got, as you can see, that little bit right there, but I can't get it out. I'm going to leave this in here to, um, after, so after I get out of the shower, and I'm going to spray and spray and see if I can get that last little corner out of there because I've been trying and I can't. I'm going to give it my la one last go tonight. And if it don't come out, then I'm going to just throw it away. The next one I have is this Versace Crystal Noir. Now, y'all know how I kept talking about this and how I just did have to have it and all of that. It smells beautiful. But I, it started driving me crazy that the bottle was empty. It kind of got like a little piece of corner in there, too. You see it right there. But I really can't get that one either. So, And when they get low, low like this, it's, I toss them. I'm done, especially if I've tried to get it out and I can't get it out. But yeah, we finally finished her because I was holding on to her, trying to, you know, you know, keep the little piece I had, but it was done. Next is this Mineralized Skin Finish Powder from MAC. This is in the shade Dark. So this is one of the powders, like if I didn't want to actually do my makeup, but I just wanted like to powder over to smooth over my face, it would be this because I have loved this Four years, this is one product that I have always liked, always enjoyed, and I always keep it in my kit, and I always keep a personal one. So this is my personal one. It is empty, but I've already replaced it. Next, we have this Third Breath Anti-Cavity Oral Rinse and Sparkle Mint. This is the pink one, okay? This is the reason why I would not be buying the Walmart brand um, mouthwash anymore. I have tried like two or three of these. I have tried these in the past. For those of you who have been here a long time, even before my perfume videos, if you have seen um, the videos, I had tried these before and I did not like them enough to keep buying them. But this one, I actually like. And this is anti-cavity. So, I was using that one in the daytime and this one at night. I already have a replacement over there. So, I was using this one as my nighttime mouthwash. That one is my daytime mouthwash. And... Now I am going to be using this as my daytime and my nighttime mouthwash. I just had to finish that one down there so I could, you know, I wasn't going to trash it. I wasn't going to pour it out get rid of it. I wanted to actually finish it. But I really, really like this mouthwash. I like the flavor of it and I like that it's anti-cavity and it kind of takes the guilt away from me. Like when I brush my teeth at night, of course, and then rinse, uh, rinse my mouth with this, that's it for the rest of the night. Because I've noticed... And when I say it takes, it takes the guilt away from me, I've noticed I hadn't been drinking my protein shake. I mean, Y'all know I have been drinking a protein shake every single day for the past eight years. Well, the last two months, I have not, maybe longer than that to be honest, I have not drank a protein shake. I want to say in like two, three months. It's probably, it's probably this year to be honest with you. I don't remember when I bought my, finished my last container, but it's been months. I've noticed it's giving me, giving me a sweet tooth. That I don't like. Um, so, I'm going to start back. But I am not going to lie. I have not missed drinking that shake every day. But I'm going to start back. Because I know I need it. Me being, I've been doing good not drinking it. And working out and still being able to build like I have. But I know i got to get back to it. Next, I have this Laneige um, Berry. This is the Berry one in there. Gloss. Is it frozen? Yep, it is. So... This one, I finished a couple of these. It's finally gone. I'm debating if I'm going to buy this again or if I'm just going to stick, stick to my Elf Lip Lip Oils. Why am I stuttering? I do like that one, but for the price, I'm like, 
Do I have to get that? Or can I just buy with like the NYX lip gloss? Um, and I'll be finished that with that soon because I really like the NYX lip gloss. It's been, I'm running through that. But last but not least, we have the Sunday Riley CEO Glow. And this is the Vitamin C and Turmeric Face Oil. I think the empty bottle's in here. Yeah, it is. So, it's empty. I already have my replacement right here. I really like this oil. I do not like the price. I want to say it's like $40 for this 15 ml. This is the 0 0.5 fluid ounce. I think it's $40, $45 for this. I really like it, but I don't like the price. It says with advanced vitamin C, turmeric, turmeric, and even in primrose oil to visibly brighten, hydrate, balance, and glow. I like it. Don't like the price, but I have been rebuying. This is with that one. I think it's my third one. I think it's my third or fourth one since I've been using it. So I do like it. But that's it, you guys. So that is all of my product empties. Um, if you guys using it, like, let me know what y'all use in the comments that I showed you guys. <sighs> It'll probably be a while before I have another product empties because I've started over everything. You know, actually my La Roche-Posay face wash, that one could have been in his, but I think I have like two more days left on that one. And then it'll be empty. Um, but yeah, that's it right now. That's, that's it. it was something else I knew that I'm still using, but it's almost empty. I can't think of it right off the top of my head. I don't know what it is. It may be in my makeup room. This is my, in that case, when I did all the bulk shopping in the case that I bought my toothpaste and all of my beauty products, this is the last one in the toothpaste. I was supposed to get toothpaste today. I completely forgot. So we're going to be squeezing out of this one in the morning before, and I'll just get another one because I have another four pack in my Amazon cart. And it's taking me forever to order because I'm looking for freaking lashes. I knew it was two things that I was forgetting. I had a case of these that is empty. This is the body wash that I love that I use every single day. And then my downy ocean mist scent bees. I went through the container of that and rebought the biggest container yesterday, well, Saturday when I went to Sam. But yeah, my battery is about to die. That is the end of this video, you guys. Before you leave, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.